Hello, English winners. I'm recording with my phone right now because of a temporary mishap. So in this video, I'm showing you how to get the subtitles. That's the words right at the bottom of the screen to show up. So here I'm doing a screen recording that shows you how to get subtitles. As you can see, I have a popular video of mine for Spanish speakers. This is me from about a year ago. I look really fat compared to now, but that's okay. Uh, so to get subtitles on a video, you take your mouse, that's the thing I got right here, and you go down to the right side where it says CC, and then you hit CC, and it should turn on the subtitles right here. Maybe it says something different in your country, but let's play. Hello, everyone. We're going to talk about Spanish speaking pronunciation errors. So that's what it looks like. You have the words at the bottom of the screen, very simple. And the CC, as you can see, is now underlined with a red line. Make sure you see that red line underneath, or else the next thing will not be available. So you can also click on this gear. It says settings, but it'll say something different in your language. You click on it, and we have subtitles in its English, auto-generated. So you can change it, and click on options here, and you can change a whole bunch of things about how your fonts show up. I can change the writing. Look at that. I can make it small capitals. I can make it proportional, monospaced. That looks like it's a screenplay or something, or casual. Ugh, that's just uh, comic sans. I don't like that at all. So I'm going to move that right back to what we had before. Yeah, proportional sans serif. You can also, also, here's another thing you can do if you want to practice your English and help English win get to the next level. Let me show you how to add subtitles for a new language at the bottom of videos. Maybe you don't know this, but you can make translations of videos. Let me show you how to do that. You take your mouse and you go down to underneath the title of the video and to the right. You should see three dots. You hit those three dots and you get an option that says add translations. I'm going to click on that and it takes me to a menu. Let's load that up and so now you can add new subtitles. I'll click on that. Search 187 other languages. Ooh, let's put uh, Spanish in there. Spanish Latin America, let's do that. And you can click on that. And here you have the option to upload a file. If you have all the words I have spoken translated in a Microsoft Word document, you can upload that document. Or you can create new subtitles. I'm going to click on that. And that way, it'll take you to a timed text section, and you can start entering in the subtitles. Like, let me show you. I could say, let's listen to this. Welcome. Let's go into the errors that are common. Okay. Welcome. Let's go into the errors that are common. Bienvenidos. Vamos al errores. Comunes. I think that's how you do it, right? So if you want to add translations in your language to English Win videos, that is great practice for you. And it also helps all the other people who speak your language and want to learn how to speak English well. And when you're finished, of course, you just hit publish right over here. I'm not going to do that because while I'm okay at Spanish, I'm not great compared to someone who lived in a Spanish-speaking country their entire life. All right? So if you do this for your native language, you translate videos like this, your skills will improve, and you'll help others who speak your language 
succeed in English as well. You'd also be doing me a huge favor, so it's a win for everybody. And that is how you use subtitles on YouTube. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe to this channel to help this video and this channel get to the very top. Thank you so much. It means a lot to me. I have included a link to another video I think you might like right over there. So don't let my head get in the way. All right? Catch you later with another video.